Figured you'd show up sooner or later, as I'm sure you're aware I specialize in the dark type. There's just a natural coolness about them, don't you think? Learn enough of that. It's a battle you came for, and a battle you'll get! Alright, we'll wrap up the episode after we beat Silver. Nice tracksuit, buddy. You look like a woman. <laughs>《Spooky fans, Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon Glazed playthrough, my very first journey through this ROM hack of Pokemon Emerald version. If you have been enjoying the series, don't forget to drop a like, make sure to answer the comment question, and if you missed the last episode, make sure you check it out. So you know what the boot is going on! We're about to head over to the Cienvine Bridge, the bridge that connects Olivine City and Cienwood City that was just opened to the public. And, uh... Who do I have in front? I guess Starfy's fine. And we're about to find out who this, if this is a trainer. It is a trainer. Oh, don't worry, I'm not a trainer. Oh, it's not a trainer. <laughs> about to find out if this is a trainer. <laughs> oh, it is a trainer. Oh, don't worry, I'm not a trainer. It's not a trainer. So I ask you, my name's Bridget, by the way. My friends and I have a challenge on this bridge, okay. If you beat all five of them, you'll get a fabulous prize. Oh, hell yeah. Let's crush her friends. Noobs! The first one to battle. You will die. Ha ha! You suck! You're second up, you will die! And you will die! Are these all gonna have water types? Dang it, not a water type. <laughs> of course, as soon as... You will die! Oh boy! I need the speed! Hello! Ah, I hate you. We did it. We beat, we beat all of them. Okay, sorry. I was just like, I want to blast through these noobs. And so I made some bad decisions and took some more damage than I needed to. Wait, what? What? What was my prize, though? What? I didn't get anything? That she didn't hand me a prize! That was dumb. Why? Why did you do this? Was it supposed to be a Pokemon and it didn't work because my party was full? I don't know. That was weird. So Chuck's Dojo. Not an official gym, but a dojo. A pharmacy? What do they sell here? All right, typical pharmacy stuff. Okay, they sell hyper potions. All right, and uh, nothing I really need. So let's leave. All right, what do we what do we got over here? Whether well, he has gorgeous, indeed. The World Island sunk. What? The obedience house. That's. Oh, okay, so there's a- oh, did they- So there's a house you can bring a Pokemon to that isn't obeying you? But what's confusing to me is that this is a, like, at this point in the game, I have all of the gym badges, any Pokemon's gonna obey me. Oh. I'm so confused. 
Hmm. Weird. All right, before we go into the dojo, Cliff Edge Cave. Oh. All right, time for a repel. Not immediately, not ready to deal with this nonsense. Where are the max repels? I'm thinking we should at least go to the next town because I can just teleport out of it. Like I'm not. I'm pretty sure it's not gonna let me fight Silver yet. Ah, freaking rock climb. Is that the only thing down here? Yeah, it is. I don't have rock climb on me. Wait a second. I could teach it to somebody and then immediately delete it. Because it's a TM and I could just teach... I could overwrite a different TM move. Yeah, let's just delete Earth Power for half a second. Because it looks like there's quite a few goodies up there that I would really like. Oh, just one. <laughs> That's just a rare candy? Okay. Oh, wait. No, wait. Don't delete Rock Climb, Mikey. You gotta get... Yeah, I gotta be able to get back down. <laughs> Uh, all right, let me find her. Well, I'll just keep it. I'll keep him with rock climb until we get out of this cave. How about that? My bag is full though All right Hardstone, okay, I don't care So essentially in this game, it's it looks like this is a similar route yeah, it looks like it's a similar route as in Hard Cold Soul Silver, um, but instead of leading to the Safari Zone, it leads to whoa, what? Where the hell is my bag? All right, well that route is glitched. Can't access my freaking bag. What on earth? Maybe this hiker's gonna say something about it, because this is, it, it doesn't let me save, and it doesn't let me access the bag. Is he gonna say something about this? Are you tough enough to take on Route 47? I'm sure I am. Ah! I need to stop speeding up so much. All right, next one is Onyx Steelix. Yeah, what we what we will we will use Frog for a Steelix. I just think it's so weird. I can't see my bag. Is this like only gonna let me heal in battle? What's this? Down the ladder leads to the beach. Up the ladder leads further up the cliffs. Let's check out the beach. Waterfall. Two different waterfalls. I feel like I need waterfall right now. <laughs> I'm gonna, and I can't access my bag. Like, what the heck? Can I access my bag if I'm inside the cave? Yeah, I can, all right. It's just the route is glitched. That's super weird. I'm gonna go ahead and teach Waterfall to Frog in place of Bounce, because I've used Bounce once and I didn't even need to use it. It like wasn't, it, it was just like a added slight bit of convenience. And I really wanna check out what's up these waterfalls. That's so weird, like I've never, that's such a weird glitch. Like, why is it? Oh, grass. Ah, my repel is still active, dang it. Hurry up! Hurry up! <laughs> I'm something to be like an item over there. How have I not run out the repel yet? Ch 
Jesus. I'm actually concerned that this that grass doesn't even work. Let me test something. No, I can't. I can't use a rappel. Are there no wild encounters? I feel like my rappel may have already run out. This route is just so glitched. But there's no wild encounters at all on this route. Because I can't access my bag to use another one. Are you kidding me? This route blows! Oh, come on! Go back to a cave to teach... I hate this route. Like, this is the worst. Oh my god. I, I just... I'm having trouble, like, believing how messed up this route is. Rock climb better actually lead to something useful, not some freaking... See that cave? That's the embedded tower. Oh. Well, clearly that's where Groudon shows up at some point, but I don't know how to activate them. My rappel wore off as soon as I exited the cave. Goodness. I'm gonna go up here and there's not gonna be anything. Yep. Alright. I just... Uh, we don't really need to go down to find... Ky Kyogre, do we? Because it's not gonna be there. Uh, we'll just see what it looks like. Oh, blue ladder. Oh, that's kind of cool aesthetic change. Yeah, all right, we can't, we, I, clearly this is where you catch them later, but I don't know how. <laughs> I wonder if I'm gonna have any wild encounters on the route now that I have, like, now that I have, my rappel wore off since I took steps inside a cave. Yeah, I am. Okay, there are Pokemon here. It's just if you have a Repel active, it screws it up because it never runs out because the bag is missing. So now let's see what we got here. Are you serious? It's Raticate and Firo and Ditto. All right, so this route is continuing to be my least favorite in the game. Requires a bunch of HMs for nothing <laughs> and doesn't let me access my bag? I away. Alright, before we go up the cliff, let's check out what's this way. It's just an item. Silver powder? Ah, I don't care about that. But we're gonna make it to this next freaking town if it kills me. Fight me, boy! We're so high up! And I will shove you off the cliff in defeat. Spartan kick this little picnic or Cedric just off the cliff into the water. This is a fortunate lead. See you, buddy. It said Drake, he lost Spartan kick Cedric off the cliff. Um, Brave Bird's neutral? Haha, -ha, it still worked! Terror matches up well against these guys. What did he say about the Safari Zone? Oh, it, maybe they kept the Safari Zone in this game. Hello, fight me, child! Haha! -ha! <laughs> Man, Terror's just great against all these guys! Protected twice. That was dumb. Let's look at the map. 
All right, so we are almost to Evergreen Town. Is this the way to the Safari Zone? It is. All right, I want to get to Evergreen Town first so I can get the teleportation place. I just I just want to get that in the books. <laughs> We got it, we got it! We're here! Alright, teleportation thing is the most important thing. We got it. So now we can teleport here back back here later and don't ever have to go on that stupid route again. I wonder if I'm making him Sceptile dizzy by teaching him these moves and changing them so much. Night Badge. Oh, is Silver the first Dark-type leader? Oh, hey, Shell. Lying behind again, I see. In any case, welcome to my hometown. It's so much nicer than Glenwood Town, don't you think? Oh, look what I have, a Night Badge. Just one off my bro. Are you gonna challenge him now? He just took off someplace. That's my brother. Can't stay in one spot. How about we battle while we're here? All right, we'll, we'll, we'll battle Shell the, the loser. And who's honestly really a jerk. Like, this is my hometown, way better than your stupid hometown. All right, we'll try and beat her fair, just for fun. You've gotta be joking. Okay, at least it just scary faced me. I should have seen that coming. All right. All right. Said I was gonna do it fair, so we're not gonna switch. What's up, Greninja? All right, Salix will tank the water move this thing is definitely going for. Yep, and now we Giga Drain. Because I'm pretty sure Greninja's quite light. All right, cool, it didn't barely survive like freaking Flareon did. That was annoying. <laughs> Woo, 65. A guard jump, oh, excellent. Dragon Pulse. I swear that's a shiny. I swear it is. But I'm not sure. <laughs> it just looks like the shiny one. It looks like less saturated, ah, heck. And that happened last time, too. I thought I could Oko with Dragon Pulse, and then I didn't. And then I was sad. Alright, Frog out speeds. It's locked into Outrage, so she's not healing, but we'll go for an Ice Beam. Alright, Garchomp goes down. A Raichu, of course. Now we switch into Nido King. The electric move does nothing. Then we Earthquake. Then she brings in, uh, what is her? I know she's got her Meganium, but then what is her last one? All right, that doesn't matter. We're okaying it here. Meganium, was it Miss Magius? No. Garchomp, Raichu, Greninja. Meganium. Flareon. Okay, she's sending Meganium right away. Maybe she's only had five Pokemon at this point. We don't know what the last one's gonna be. Yeah, Silver's definitely a Dark-type gym leader. Because it just fit, like, a lot of times his cano can canonical starter is for Alligator, and they made for Alligator a Dark-type in this game. Oh, it's Crobat, okay. They made for Alligator a dark type in this game. Um, so he's gonna have like Weavile. He's gonna have uh, for Alligator. Oh God, that does a lot.
Um, probably a Honchcrow. I feel like he had a Murkrow. I don't know. I can't remember. Moo Moo Milk. Okay, that's weird. Guess I just gave all flying Pokemon Brave Bird in this game. Because in the main series, it's like, you only get Brave Bird if you're actually a, a brave bird. But if you're not a bird, you don't get it. But in this game, it's like, nah, if you have wings, you're good. <laughs> Beat her again. Why do I keep losing? Because you suck. You don't make strategic switches. Better head off now. I have lots of training to do before I take on Claire. Okay, so he's intended to be the second to last one. My prediction is that I have to go up to um, Whitewood Town, where the Psychic Gym Leader is, before I can beat Silver. That's my prediction. Maybe? I have to go find him. Okay, maybe I just have to find him somewhere? Let me guess, this waterfall leads absolutely nowhere, like almost every waterfall in this game. Oh. Okay, so they made it so all the f Route 47 Pokemon in the can only be accessed if you are surfing, which is kind of an interesting decision. Or if you have waterfall. Close have a dark secret. What? Captain Sean's house. Hey, Captain. Oh, they call me Captain Sean around these parts. If you want to get to Ranko, I'm the man for the job. You got a ticket, right? Can't take anybody to Ranko unless I got a ticket. All right, so I have to to beat the league before we can go to Rancor, which is very logical. Surfing race. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, this is a long day. Oh, is this like the ski thing? This has got to be like the ski thing. Or I'm just trying to go for the best time, but because the internal battery has run dry, there is no time, and this is just a giant waste of time. Oh god, I'm going in every which wrong possible direction. Jesus Christ. <laughs> what? Wait, what? Oh. Oh, it actually... Oh, it did time me. Wait, let's try it again now that I kind of know the path. Oh, hell. Wait, which one was it? <laughs> No? Well, god damn it! <laughs> okay, it's farthest to the right, and then I have to go up. My stupid bag is full. What can I toss? I want to hold on to that blank CD just because I don't know what it is. I just want to get the top freaking first place prize, whatever. Booyah, got it this time. C Jewel. Ooh, what is that? Is that how I like summon Kyogre maybe? Like do I take that to the the place where you catch Kyogre and just use it? 
I don't know. Well, regardless, I don't really care. <laughs> That's, I'm not going all the way back there. Oh, hello, dearie, that blonde hair, you must be Michael, right? Chills told me all about you, just like my little silver couldn't stop talking about Ethan all those years ago. Why don't you stay for a bit? Don't think anything of it. Okay. Oh, oops. That's quite a sw- Whoa, what? All right, thank you for informing me of that, Michelle's mom. Didn't, thank you for that information. I was just, <laughs> used to be quite the swinger in my day. Okay, all right, thank you for that. Thank you, woman I just met. All right, let's go check out the safari zone. But then, we should make our way to Evergreen. I wonder how much this is gonna be like the, uh, the actual one. 12 areas. So is it randomized which zone I get to go to? Oh. I see. Let's go to the wasteland. I see how this works. I'm not gonna... Screw you, Machop! Jesus! There you go. Where's that teleporter pod? I don't have any bait. Where do I even get bait? <laughs> Let's check out a different zone. Um. Ocean? I don't remember that zone being a thing. Okay. Just seeking? All right, screw this. I'm tired of this already. I do not care. Let's just go to, we'll teleport back here later, but for the time being, we just need to go to the town of the north. What is it, what is it called? Are my Pokemon healed? Yeah, they are. So we're gonna teleport to Ecritique. Look how fast that is. It's just like zoop, 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 zoop. <laughs> oh, whoa, it's just that one. That's kind of cool. Oh, my God. You've got to be kidding me. Oh wait, this grass is walkable. Okay, for a second I thought those were all cuttable pieces of bamboo, and I was like, I just have to cut through all of this a thousand times? Are you kidding? And then it, I didn't, and I was like, I was very relieved. Like, what are you? <laughs> just like speeding up and mashing Fortress. Okay, that's kind of cool. All right, dead end. Grass Pokemon have the advantage in so much grass. Uh, actually they don't. There is no grassy terrain in this generation. You get nothing. Tanjale! Tangolo! Throat! Okay, cool. <laughs> I really was great with my words there. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of flamethrowers pretty quick. But I have three Pokemon that are good against flying types, so I'm not gonna, or grass types, so I'm not gonna, a Drapion, all right. 
Oh, what up, Haxorus? Jesus! Whew! I was a little worried there for a second, but it turned out fine. I didn't see what it was. Dang it! Turned out fine. All is well. All right, made it through the bamboo forest. Round 48, another trainer. I will fight you and destroy you, you little lame, huh? By shop, drain punch, you're dead. Why are these po trainers like, what is going on here? Dun, 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 dun. Would you like to battle? Uh, I mean, uh, grr, let's battle, punk. Whatever, dude. Need to Oko some dragons. <laughs> I'm blocked off? Gligar? Okay, I can get through this way. Hopefully this doesn't reach a dead end because I don't know how else it, it reaches a dead end. How else do I get rid of these guys? I'm not sure what else to do. Like, my next thing to do is either battle Silver, which, as we've discussed, I can't. Because he's gone. And so I assumed it was this one? Another blank CD. Wait, what do I do? I can't progress, but where do I go? I'm really, like, confused that I can't progress through here. That's not a dive. The only thing I can think of is going to Mahogany. Why would they have me come all the way through here only for it to be blocked off? I need to look this up, hold on a minute. All right guys, so here we are back on Route 38 that I manually walked back through, because turns out we do have to beat Silver first. Um, it's so, it is incredibly bad game design that there's still a roadblock, even after getting Fury Cutter. There should have been a roadblock sooner, so I didn't go all the way through the forest, but we have to go to Seenwood City and do some battles in the dojo, which I skipped earlier. But I don't even know if Silver would have been there until I got to Evergreen. But Silver's in here. So we have to do battles here first. Silver will return to the gym, and then we beat Silver, and then we can go to Evergreen. There he is. Hi, oh, Michael. I'm just here to see if there's any good battles. If you had nothing interesting, though, could you liven this place up by battling one of the people here? So this is just a rematch place? Um, well, let's battle Leaf. So they might just want me to battle some of the old gym leaders. All right. Let's just battle the grass type one, whose typing I definitely remember. All right. You beat me the first time, buddy. You ain't beating me again. Leftovers taking forever. We'll do a fair battle, though, you know? Just because it's like, oh, the dojo. Do gym battles that are fair in the dojo. So we'll do that. No. Fortunately, you're Grass Dragon. So... What does he go for here? I think Terror's a good... Well... Actually, we're gonna switch into Quake. Because I think Quake will tank a hit better. 
Never mind. Thought it would go for a dragon move. And we actually did tank that better than I thought. All right, we switch into, he goes for earthquake again. No, he doesn't. What on earth? <laughs> what is this septile doing? All right. That was so weird. Doesn't go for Earthquake again. I don't, I don't understand. I'll never understand. I mean, I understand why you went for Earthquake on Infernape, but why not go for Earthquake again? So weird. It's been a weird episode. <laughs> just so much like randomly bad stuff. Like not horrible stuff, but just like the whole like that route where you can't access your bag and just like Doing all those HMs for nothing good, it's just like... Weird episode. Weird... Weird episode. Okay. We're just gonna finish this out with Terror. Alright, we finished it out with Terror. God, Brave Bird Rockhead is the best move on the team. <laughs> My poor babies. Suck it, Leaf! Hi, right, Michael. Thanks for allowing me to get the plays of the battle. Your battle with Leaf was riveting. Souls have hung here long enough. Better get back to my gym. Is this Chuck? All right. That was fine. So now I think we can go battle Silver. Which should be Spicy Manto. Because we only have one Pokemon that's good against Dark types. <laughs> Evergreen Town. Whoa. Do you get a dark vibe from this place? It's good. This is Deoxys's music. Because Silver Train's the dark type. You'll need to keep your wits about that's for sure. All right, well. It might take us a bit to figure this puzzle out. I'd like to complete this gym in this episode, though. I want to do at least one gym per episode. Such friendly music! <laughs> if you say diligent, you make it to the end just to be crushed by silver. No? I hate puzzles like this. Isn't our floor scary? It's freaking annoying is what it is. Oh, I didn't even mean to use flamethrower. <laughs> that was funny. No! No. How do I battle fat guy? There's no way to tell what's floor and what's not. Okay, I guess we're just not gonna battle that other fat guy. That's fine, I don't really care. Let's go heal and go fight. Dark Silva. Jubilee is currently friend safari hunting in her version of X, which is not her version of X. She lost her version of X a, a while ago, and so she just bought one off like Craigslist for cheap, and the person didn't delete their old file. And so she's just like using this random file of random Pokemon that this person had. And it's very funny because. <laughs> oh, I misclicked! Freaking ball sacks. 
She the the person has an Aegis Slash or Aegis Slash as it's supposed to be pronounced. That's called Doc Claw, <laughs> and I'm just thoroughly amused by that name because it's just like it's so cheesy. Like <laughs> I am the name. <laughs> just he's not even a he's a sword. Figured you'd show up sooner or later, as I'm sure you're aware I specialize in the dark type. It's just a natural coolness about them, don't you think? Not enough of that. It's a battle you came for, and a battle you'll get. All right, we'll wrap up the episode after we beat Silver. Nice tracksuit, buddy. You look like a woman. Freaking, of course he leads with Hunch Crow. Ah, we do not keep him in. That is dangerous. Terra's a good counter for this. Man, that is such a strong move. It did that that much damage and was resisted. Come on, be enough. Booyah! Crit! I hope the crit didn't matter, but regardless, I'm still hyped about that. Weavile. Um, we'll rock slide again. Booyah! Man, Terror's killing it in this episode! Luxray. Oh, Luxray's electric dark in this game! I haven't seen one of those in a while. Alright, go Quake. It obviously goes for an electric move here. Roastado Tostadoed. Booyah! I was honestly expecting him to be the last gym leader, but I guess they were just like, nah, we'll keep Claire. Because she said, I'm going to go battle Claire. So Claire is still a gym leader. Hi, Dragon. Ooh! That was a weird sound I just made. All right, we'll probably let Quake go down here. Safe switch in. Unless we get a freeze, which would be dope. But I'm... I think that's unlikely. Oh, wow, okay. That's fine. All right, Tyrese is weak to earth power, but is definitely faster, so. A little bit of extra. Now an Iron Fist Drain Punch. Booyah! Alright, what's his last one gonna be? I think it's gonna be for alligator. Bisharp! Okay, it's not a for alligator, it's a Bisharp. So even easier to beat than a for alligator, because this is guaranteed Oko. Ah <laughs> oh, man, I'm disappointed they didn't even give him for alligator though. Like for alligator's a dark type. Silver is always shown with a freaking for alligator. I don't know. That's weird. I thought that would have given him for alligator. I know how to take defeat gracefully. Here's your badge. Thanks. He really does look like a mom. Like a rich mom in a tracksuit, you know? Stereotypically, like power walking through the suburbs. That's what he looks like. The Knight Badge. That badge will allow you to use dig outside of battle. What? Could I not already? I know they talked about like digging at the divots, but like digging to escape caves wasn't, haven't I always been able to do that? Oh, he, he said ash. That's fine. I say, that's not a word that I am worried about censoring. All right, guys. Well, we got our sixth gym badge. And so according to the walkthrough, the next place we can go is Evergreen, or, um, Whitewood City. So, 
Uh, that's what we're gonna do. I think off camera, I'm gonna go ahead and just get to the place where the battle people were blocking our way. Um, and that'll be the start of next episode. So, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to drop a like. Make sure to answer the comment question, and that is all I have for now. So, until next time, big fans! Gotta catch them all!